Okay, so I want to describe how to put the, um, the tubing first of all into the membrane chip interface. Um, the tubing is quite rigid and it's got to go through a bit of a, a 90 degree angle to get it into place. So the easiest way to do that is to just to cut a, a fine um, diagonal slice off of the end of the tubing. So that's the first one. And the second one. Okay. Right. Um, what you have here on the outside is uh, two openings where the tubing goes through. That comes through the block and then out at right angles, and it will emerge at, um, at these uh, these two holes here. So the idea is to push the tubing now past those openings, um, so we can then trim that so it's, the ends are flush. We'll put on the o-ring seal and then pull the tubing back flush to the o-ring. Okay, so the next step is to push the tubing through. So it goes into the holder here. Push that through. It will be a little, a little tight to get through, but um, just uh, push hard. So that's the first one through. And now the second one. It's much easier doing this with uh, wearing gloves. I suggest that you would use a, a fairly tight fitting glove that's, uh, that's powder free. So now both of those pieces of tubing have, have come through the opening. So if I now trim those off with uh, one of our um, tubing cutters, it is important to get a good um, perpendicular edge. So this is by far the best way to do it. There we go, there's the first one. That one flush. Let's fit that through again. So now you can hopefully see that we have two flush ends. Okay, so now the easiest thing to do is actually just clamp that tubing in place by pushing that into the latch there. Okay, so now we need to fit the O-rings to the tubing. Push that over the top and push that down into the, the recess as much as possible. Don't worry if it doesn't sit completely flat at this stage. By the time the chips are in place, that'll all be pushed down flat. And the second one. Also in place. Okay, so now we just need to adjust the tubing so it's um, level with the, the metal of the, the base part. So make sure the latch is open. And now pull that down. And the same with the other side. If you go too far, the o-ring will just ping off and you'll need to start again. But uh, that should hold the, uh, the o-ring in place. Then secure the tubing by pushing it into the latch. That's now ready to put the rest of the chip together.